Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. In this equation, I will present our paper with the title Regression Analysis Model for Estimating the Resource Needs of School Construction Project. The author of this paper are I, Baikun, lecturer and civil engineering student at Nusa Putri University, namely Bapadi Prasetyo, Rival Padila, and Randy Muhammad. As well as lecturer, a lecturer at Nusati University, Trihono Kadri. Introduction in this paper is that the number of generic schools in Indonesia based on the Ministry of Education and Culture Statistical Data compared to the number of study group and the availability of classroom is experiencing the of 3,843 classroom. A total of 358 percent more class of elementary major school in Indonesia based on the Ministry of Education and Culture Data Statistics for 2018-2019 are in the following condition. This is 100 of thousand of class in good condition and 26 thousand more of this condition was likely demise and this 20,000 more separately demise condition and then more than 11,000 condition were totally demise. Okay. Indonesia needs to build new classroom of more than 15 person classroom. Classroom construction requires resources. Implementation of school construction currently requires resources. Resources needed are generally money, material, manpower, and equipment. Therefore, it is necessary to go in its frame how much money, material, manpower, and equipment are needed before the implementation of school construction. To be able to predict the net the needs of these resources requires special expertise and needs to be supported by complete data. The implementation of school renovation construction or the construction of new classroom must be carried out in a self-managed manner by the development committee in the education unit referring to Republic of Indonesia Presidential Regulation year 2018 regarding technical instruction and social physical allocation. The problem is that all education provider have human resources with the special expertise in the construction. Even if the human resources in question exist, exit, predicting resources, net requires complete data. Take a long process, it takes long time. So it can be considered a difficult task. Method that can be used to predict cost, material, manpower, and equipment, including the the OA method, and in Indonesia is updated as the national standard SNE. This method produces a bill of quantity. It's a traditional method, and is and is considered less accurate. The research objective is predict to needs for money, manpower, and material on a class construction project without complete data. Adding a model to predict the net of money, 
manpower and matter in the classroom construction project. At the program to predict the nest of money, manpower, and material in a classroom construction project. This is question. Can the net of money, manpower, and matter in a class construction project be predicted without complete data? Two. Is it possible? Make an accurate model to predict the net of money, manpower, and material in class in a class construction project. Can the model be used as an accurate and predictable program for predicting the net for money, manpower, and material in a classroom construction project? To answer the research question. The resource was carried out using the resource for us in the following figure. Data needed in this study are construction project carrying, project bill of quantity document, cost budget plan document. From this data, it processes into data on construction cost, material, and manpower according to the R of each building. And then, definition of the decision variable. Variable Y and variable X. Wielding area is the independent variable. And then, regression analysis. Regression analysis and simulation model. Simulation model. So in figure, after the model axis, and compare it into a program from the bill of quantity and cost budget and data, data grouping and data presentation, and then made so that further statistical analysis can be made. Example of process result so in as construction covering an R of 144 meter requires a cost requires a cost of 144 million 195,244 rupiah and request material in here. Chain seventy one point five cubic meter and man twenty two thousand four hundred and eighty seven kilogram gravel break congestion and so on. Use of manpower worker, bricklayer, carpenter, painter. For men in this data. After grouping and presenting the data, the statistical analysis uses, uses regression analysis. The result of data processing in the variables and in the stack before the regression analysis is performed, the decision variable is explained as the dependent variable. It's a tethered Y, and the independent variable is the tethered X. The independent variable X, the area of the classroom building, where the dependent variable Y in the study consists of 25 tapers. So the variable Y is tethered Y, construction course, Y1 sand, Y2 cement. One three grapple and so on. Two twenty five model and then application program. The application program in this study uses Microsoft Excel. Make a program using the Excel application in run one. Come with building area. And column B is spec for building area input. 
In round two, in column E, write description. In column D, write the model. In column C, write the unit price. In column D, write amount. In round three, in column E, write the total construction cost. In column B, and the model Y. For example, in here, in row four, in column E, write shen cubic meter. In column B, write model Y1, or write is. In column C, as the input spec, to manually fill in the unit phase of Shen in from the rights model in row five and should do the same thing as row four. Write the material name, paper, worker in column E, write model Y2 to YMC. In column B, write model in column D and ignore the column C. Okay, conclusion. In this study, have found a solution to the problem of the difficulty of predicting resources in construction projects, especially for school construction commits in the education unit. These resources in a new classroom construction project which consists of money, material, and manpower can now be predicted using a model because the model has been compared to the program that's predicting the construction resources of new school space using the program by inputting data in your classroom in the program. It will automatically predict the amount of money, material, and manpower needed. Leading construction resources using this program is very easy and can save a lot of time when compared with the BOA in SNI method because online need to enter building area information, whereas if using the BONSNI method for a long process, the data must be complete. It must identify the quantity of the link component must analyze one by one. The written research records using the result of this research program online has error below 5%, so the program is worth using. This was the presentation of the paper and title regression analysis model for estimating research equipment for school. The flop project. Thank you.